How much weight can a concrete block support? If you're planning a construction project and wondering how much weight a concrete block can handle, you're in the right place. Let's break down the details to help you make informed decisions. First, it's important to understand that the weight a concrete block can support isn't just about its size. Several factors come into play here, including the block's material, its structural context, and how it's used. The material used in the construction of a concrete block significantly affects its load-bearing capacity. For example, a block made with stone dust is generally stronger than one made with sand. Stone dust gives the block more weight and strength compared to sand. The size and shape of the block also matter. A larger block with holes can actually bear less weight than a smaller solid block. This is because the holes reduce the overall solid material in the larger block, even though it distributes weight over a greater area. Structural context is another key factor. How the block is used in the structure affects its load-bearing capacity. For instance, a block supporting a column will bear less weight than the same block supporting a slab because the weight on a column is more concentrated. Additionally, blocks used in a wall can support more weight collectively than individual blocks used as standalone load-bearing units. According to ASDM standards, all concrete blocks must support at least 1,700 pounds per square inch psi. However, this is just the minimum requirement. Actual blocks can support much more weight depending on their specific properties. For example, an 8-inch block that is about 50% solid can withstand around 120,000 pounds before breaking, but in real-world applications, the load is much less due to safety factors. The way the block is oriented also makes a difference. Blocks with their cores and face shells vertical are stronger than those with their cores horizontal. This is why it's not advisable to use blocks with their cores in the horizontal position. In terms of specific numbers, a standard 8x8, x16 cinder block, when used in a wall, can support a significant amount of weight. The allowable load depends on the height of the wall and other structural elements. For example, blocks in a wall can collectively support heavier loads than individual blocks, especially if the wall is reinforced with steel beams. To determine the exact load-bearing capacity of a concrete block, you would need to test it in its specific context. This involves applying weight to the block until it cracks and then calculating the pressure that caused the breakage relative to the block's surface area. In summary, the weight a concrete block can support varies widely based on its material, size, shape, and how it's used in the structure. Always consider these factors and adhere to safety standards to ensure your construction project is stable and secure.